guys, I'm going to film a Dollar Tree haul today. I was going to do my makeup, but I'm kind of in a rush, so I'm like, I'm just not going to do it. So, um, anyways, this is a couple of fruit trips. Um, just because the last time I went, I went like right after I filmed my last haul. It was just a small trip because I just went to get back. Sorry, my allergies are so bad, guys. I went back to get more of those glittery frames. So we'll start with that first trip. I straight up got 11 <laughs> more of these frames. You don't really need to see all 11 of them, I guess. But they're just these gold glittery frames. I literally bought them out because I just really like the look of them. And I want to, like, like I said in the last video, I like my frames to match. So I just wanted to make sure that I have enough of them for, like, if I needed to use them more. So here's... <laughs> Here's the rest of them, these gold ones. Um, and then I found a couple of more of those little Disney storybooks. Sorry about all the wrestling, guys. A couple more of the Disney storybooks. So I got Mickey, is it Ticker Trouble? Oh no, Ticket Trouble, I can read it. And it's just like a little generic Mickey Mouse storybook. They have some based off the movies, but there's a lot of these that are just like random little stories um and then I got 101 Dalmatians Puppy Parade I wonder if I already have this actually I hope not but yeah it's just really cute I got these because A like if I really wanted to I could cut them up and use them for like artwork or whatever I want to use them for but um I am going to have a kid eventually and I thought these would be a cute little collection of storybooks for us to have so um, I went to two different Dollar Trees. This is from, it's the one that I normally go to. And I found these hummingbird lights. Oh, I think it's because it's not dark now. <laughs> but it was just on. So they're so cute. They're little solar lights. I don't know if I can like, there we go. No. Anyway, they're so cute. They're these the little solar panels right here and the flowers right here. Hummingbirds here. And it was just lighting up in the bag because it was dark enough. But <laughs> see, like my light turns it off. But whatever. I want to have a couple of plants outside my door when we move. And I thought these would just look cute, like, stuck inside the planters. I found these little puffy pens. They're so, so, but they're so cute. So they're silver and they just have these, like, puff balls. Like, kind of ones that people are, like, like, like to put on their purses. Okay. So first, I, so I have, like, a little basket gift thing I'm putting together for my mom for Mother's Day. The basket I just bought. But I'll see that in a second. But I got this little gift basket sack well it's two so I'll have an extra one but just to wrap around the gift basket and then I thought this um tissue paper would look cute with what I'm getting her so I got her that to put in the basket with the stuff <laughs> and then I found this frame and I've seen it a couple times and I was like no you don't need it but I just really thought it was cute it says forever and always and it's got this little clip right here where you clip the photo. And my plan is to just put a picture of my boyfriend and I in there. I found some new scrunchies. I was hoping to find some scrunchie ones, but I didn't see any. But it's just a black, white, and blue one. I just like using scrunchies. I prefer them over hair ties. They rip less of my hair out, and they're just more comfortable for me to use. Um, my friend has been looking everywhere for this, so I picked it up for her. And it says, Life is um, my favorite adventure, and it's got all these cacti on it. It's really cute. Cacti and succulents, I think. No, I think they're all cacti. But they had another one that was plant a garden and see how it will grow or something like that. And it was a similar artwork, but this is the one that she was wanting, so I picked it up for her. I wanted some more. I keep, like, microfiber wipes in my car so because I'm lazy and I go through a drive through car wash. So while I'm in the drive through I, like, wipe everything inside the car down. So I just got a couple more of those to keep in my car. I got a few things, just miscellaneous things. Um, I got this little dog toy just because I thought it was cute and it's really soft. They'll probably rip it apart, honestly, but purple's my favorite color, so I just picked that up. And then I, I know that everybody talks shit about these flip-flops and, like, says that they break and stuff, so I'm going to be, I'm going to tread carefully where I wear them, but I just thought they were so cute. So it's metallic -y pink on the strap and then it's got the pineapples and they're just so adorable. Like, how do you not, for a dollar, like... Not resist. Some other really cute designs, but this is the one that just like spoke to me, you know? They're just so cute. So I was really excited about this dude. It's a little stormtrooper and he's silver. It's actually a piggy bank, 
it's got the light thing at the bottom, but I thought this would look cute, um, well, cute, whatever. I'm going to decorate my boyfriend's game room and, like, save our video games. I'm going to try to sink some Star Wars in there. He likes Star Wars. He just was saying he didn't, I don't know. He's being picky, but I thought either he could put it at his desk or we could keep it in his game room. I just think it's so cool looking. I think it's just a decor piece, you know? <gasps> Did I get a broken one? No, I didn't. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, I thought it was so cool to find this for a dollar. They also had Kylo Ren, but I just wanted the Stormtrooper. I found these little squishums, and I know before they were keychains, but these ones are, like, they're just little squishies, and you can squeeze them and stuff. So they're kind of like fidgety toys. Let's see if I can open it up. So I got, like, an elephant, and I think this is a little polar bear. I'm not sure what else he would be, but they're just, see, they're just really squishy. And you can squeeze them, and they kind of stick. I think you have to be a little bit careful because you don't want to rip them. But they can, like, stick, and then you can just, like, they smell kind of weird, but for a dollar, they're cute. But, yeah, it's just a little elephant. They're just little squishies. I like squishies, so <laughs> if you can tell. So, next, I got a couple of sticker books. Um, I got the first Disney Princess sticker collection when it came out. Um, this is a new one, and I know it's new because I don't think the last one had Jasmine. Does this one have Aurora? Maybe this is the same one. No, this is new because the last one didn't have Aurora. I would remember because I love Aurora, and Aurora's right here. But here's the pages. So it's very, very similar to the first one I got. But there's some differences. This one's really cute. Like, they didn't have that either. So, yeah. This is definitely a new one. These are some glittery ones. And I like to use these for planner spreads. So. Um, and then I also found this Mickey 90th anniversary sticker collection. Obviously had to pick that up. They've been doing a lot of cute stuff for his 90th. Like, there's been a lot of, um, like, stuff at Target. Like, all kinds of places. Like, I got that 90th anniversary bag from Dollar Tree, too. So this will make a really cute Mickey planner spread. I needed a new air freshener spray from, well, I was going to get a label one from Target, but I was at Dollar Tree, so I figured I'd just pick it up, because I really like the fresh lemon spray, so, or smell, so I just went and got this to keep in our bathroom. And lastly, I just got this little basket to put my mom's Mother's Day gift in, and that is it. So I hope you guys enjoyed my Dollar Tree haul, and I will see you next time. Bye!